What's up guys, Brian Grant from ContestChampion.com here and today I want to run some numbers for you and figure out exactly how many two star crystals it takes to make a five star crystal. By the way, I'm not opening these two stars in this video, I just think this looks really cool. I'll open them in the next video just in case some of you actually wanted to see that. But what I mean is when you duplicate a two star champion, you get three star shards. With enough of these three star shards, you make a three star crystal, which can in turn be opened to duplicate a three star champion and gain some four star shards. Repeat this process enough times and you will get five star shards from duping your four star champ. And eventually you'll get enough five star shards to actually open up a drum roll, please. Five star crystal! Bum, bum, bum. I have no idea if you guys could even hear that sweet drum roll I just did beating on my desk while hunched over so my headset microphone could pick it up. Anyway, now you may be thinking, yeah, right, that'll take forever. And, well, yeah, it will take forever. But I want to know exactly how long forever is. Kind of a throwback to Diablo 2 where people calculated how many L runes it would take to make a Zod rune. Ah, good old Diablo 2. So, now it's time to bust out that calculator and run some numbers. One quick disclaimer is that to have accurate numbers, we have to assume that you duplicate a champion every time you open a crystal. It's just too hard to calculate otherwise. Also, premium hero crystals were left out of the calculations because we don't know the exact percentages of getting two, three, or four star champions from them. We have decent estimates, but that's for another video. Now I'd like to proudly introduce one of the ugliest Excel sheets ever made, which technically isn't even made using Excel. I am so sorry for this atrocity, but don't worry, I'll explain what each of these numbers mean. The left column we have crystals, two, three, four, and five stars, of course. Uh, in the next column we have shards to make a crystal, so we need 2,000 shards to make a 3 star, 2,000 to make a 4 star, and 10,000 to make the 5 star. And we have shards gained from duping, so if you duplicate a 2 star, you get 55 3 star shards. If you duplicate a 3 star, you get 55 4 star shards. And the same thing goes for duplicating a 4 star, you get 275 5 star shards. Next column here we have the number of crystals to open before getting a full crystal of the next tier. And this is pretty standard at 36.36. So if you're ever wondering why they give you 275 of these uh, five-star shards whenever you duplicate a four-star champion, it's to go along with the other numbers that they have in place here. All right, lastly, the important stuff here, the number of two-star duplicates required to make each crystal. So to make a three-star crystal, we needed 36.36 as we already found out to make a four star from duplicating two star champions you would need to duplicate a little over 1300 of them and to make a five star from duplicating two star champions you need about 48,000 that's quite a bit more than I actually thought when I first set out to make this video but we also end up knowing something else pretty cool which is the relative value of each crystal compared to a 5 star. I made this nice little graphic to show that. Ah yes, so nice. These numbers represent the total amount required to gain one 5 star champion. But if you just open up a 5 star crystal without making any dupes along the way, you'd be missing out on some sweet awakening levels. So if Kabam ever offers you 48 thousand two star crystals or one five star crystal take the 48,000 why would Kabam ever offer that that was a very dumb dumb thing I just said anyway that's gonna do it for this video ladies and gents I've got plenty more coming soon including more math stuff like this so if you're into this kind of thing and want to see more all you got to do is hit that subscribe button also of course there will be more plenty more crystal opening videos coming soon. Alright, thanks for watching.